Girl, giving her a lot of trust. Stevie, thank you. Come on. Stevie, wait. Good, okay. So I'm doing, when I say the word wait, I'm looking for her to stop moving and put her little butt on the ground. Stevie, wait. Good. And I'm using e-collar pressure. I'm just tapping until she does it. Good girl. Okay. She was doing it and now she's stopped. So, um, out. Good girl. Yes, that was very good. Um, I'm going to go back to focusing on how I reward it. So when she does sit all the way, I'm gonna reward that. CV, wait! Good girl. So right there, good. Give her, good. Okay, and let her be done. Okay. So I'm showing her the value in it so that she wants to do it more often. Um, calling her to me, Stevie, come. Good girl, yes. Okay, um, other than the weight, I'm only using the e-collar if there's non-compliance. So let's see, we'll call away from it. Out, come, good, good girl, yes. So there, I didn't use any e-collar. Um, we've already paired the e-collar meaning, so now it's just back up to non-compliance. So with the weight, that's a newer behavior that I'm implementing, so I am using e-collar initially. Um, so I'll ask her, to wait with the e-collar when her tucky, when her tucky, when her tushy, tuckus, I think I was combining words, when her butt hits the ground, that is when I will discontinue stem. Stevie, come. Yes, good girl. Yeah. That time I did use a tap on the second, second of that, just because she looked like she was going to keep moving forward. Good girl. Okay. Um, that was more of like a, she was a little too far away from me moment the leash was not somewhere where I could reach if she decided to keep moving and there's a person coming out of their house so I decided to be a little bit more enthusiastic on getting her to come back to me for safety's sake. Stevie come good girl yes that was just verbal very good okay and so I'm calling her to me giving her a treat and then releasing her with that neutral okay meaning she can go back to doing what she wanted to do so that way she's not feeling so out. Good girl, yes. So obligated to staying with me and she's not thinking, oh, she's taking me away from fun every time she calls me away. Just so she's finding value and coming back to me. Um, creating almost like a little muscle memory of a check-in. And every time she goes to pick something up with her mouth. All right, come. Thank you. Ah, nope. So now I'm gonna grab my e-collar. No. Stevie, come. Yes, good girl. And I will pay her because there's a big bag right there that she wanted to go sniff. Maybe it's a body. I don't want you to find that. Come on, okay. <laughs> um, I don't know what I was saying. But yeah, so I want her to have that little muscle memory of checking in. It's something that she enjoys doing because she gets something out of it and she's not expected to do anything past it. I just want her, nope, out. Uh-uh, out. Oh, out. Uh-uh, out. So now I'm gonna use my e-collar because she's holding on to it. Out. Good. And I used the vibrate. That when she just reacted like that, that was the vibration button because she wasn't listening to the stem, which is on an eight. Out. Yes. Thank you. Good. And that time because she listened, I rewarded. Pretty good. We don't eat random wipes that we find on the ground. That's yucky. Didn't your mom ever teach you about germs? She's got a little messy booty. We're gonna have to give you a little mini bath when we get back. You need to learn how to poop better. I guess I'm the trainer, huh? I'll teach you how to poop. Yeah. Out. Yeah, good girl. Okay, hey, sit. Good. 